and we're back to learning Inkscape and this time I'm going to show you how to create a relief print text effect. We've got a simple filter for that but if you want to adjust it you have to trick a little bit around. Let us just use the origin here, Control D, I copy it and I use the filter under bumps. You can press Control D to layer copies on top of one another but it's only a minor adjustment. Let me just add like four or five copies and you can see that. So it's really just a slight change. But you can also use the sharp more under image effects. It adds details. If you want to darken it, the only way that I could come up with is to use the original, put it on top, then go to object, fill in stroke and play around with the opacity. But it takes away some of the details. So what you may want to do is to combine the last two methods. So let us put this opaque one here. And I add the sharp more effect to the bottom one. You don't want to overdo it. Let me do it two times. And then we have a lot of grain or a lot of artifacts that we don't want to have. So in most cases you can only add this sharpen more effect once, maybe twice, and then add the opaque original version on top. If you then want to export it, press Ctrl A because it's two elements. See them right there with the two bounding boxes. You may want to put it in a group, so Ctrl G, and now you can export it like a regular object. And this is how you can create this relief print effect in Inkscape. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.